A while ago, I made a video about how to display taxonomy terms in different colors with clock block jet engine. And as you can see, so you can display uh, different category in different colors like that. Um, but the problem is, um, if you put the second category, uh, you can actually display two different colors. So I got the lots of comment about uh, my video and I got asked a lot how to um, display two different color or well, two or three different colors if they has multiple categories. So, so as you see, the problem is um, if you put the two different categories, it shows only one color, even though I set, uh, you know, green event like this, but the, this like wow event is going to be orange. But now I can show you how to display if you pick multiple category and then show in different colors like this. So, hi, my name is Osamu Wakabayashi from Zen Ideas. Uh, let's get started. So first of all, I have, it's called the event. So that's a custom post type and I have those event categories. So it's already set it up. So community, governance, and wow event. So those three categories are taxonomies. And then the next, um, what you have to do is go to Jet Engine and then create the listings, okay? So add a new listing. So the listing source would be terms. And then categories, so I'm gonna pick event categories. And then, so just gonna name it to uh, event taxonomies. And I'm gonna use Elementor. And what you have to do is just take, uh, pick the one column and right here. So you're going to just uh, edit column here and go to style. So the background type is a uh, classic. So pick this and the color. So you pick color and you see this dynamic tag. So pick that. And uh, what you want to choose is term field. Okay. And then so that, uh, uh, so even the category. So that's what I'm going to use uh, for this demo. And then the field is, uh, I want to pick a meta field, right? So that the meta field is going to be color. So, um, sorry. So if you don't know um, this, um, yeah, probably you can look at uh, my previous tutorial, uh, but let me just uh, um, take you back here. So just one sec, I'm going to just uh, pause my video. All right, um, here, so go to a uh, Jetta engine and then go to taxonomy and then event category. And then, so I've got the color here as a meta field for taxonomy. And then, so this is the name ID. All right. Um, here, just take you back here. So you go to event category. And then, so if you do that, so you see this color here. Okay. And then for example, so if you click edit, so you can pick uh, whichever color you want to put on the label. So again, so this is, you can watch uh, all through that my, in my previous uh, tutorial. And so let's go back to uh, this element over here. So once again, so event category, uh, middle field, and then it's color, right? So the next one is, I'm going to just bring these headings here. And then, uh, so I'm going to need that. And then, uh, oops, and I use dynamic tag, and then you want to pick is uh, terms field, and then so I'm going to pick uh, event categories in my case, and then so terms name is fine. All right, so uh, let's pick uh, maybe h6, small one is good, and then go to um, style and change the color. Uh, I'm going to just pick white, okay, okay, and then hit that update. And let's go back to uh, dashboard again and then go to jet engine and then listings. Now I have this event grid listing. So edit with Elementor. All right, so I don't have any uh, category here. Now, so what you wanna bring up is um, listing grid. Okay, so just bring it here. And then so listing will be uh, taxonomy. Yeah, it's right here. So it's right here. And the column number, I think, yeah, the three is okay. 
the next one is you have to set the terms query. So you have to put this macro uh, current ID and then hit update. Okay. Now let's go to um, the home page here. Go to this. And then let's see. So now you can see uh, two different category and two different colors. Now let's go back to dashboard. I want to do uh, some testing again. So go to events. Okay, so let's uh, edit this one. And then let's pick three, all the categories and hit update. And then I think, so this is the one. So I'm gonna just to refresh this page. So as you see, I got three different label, different colors. All right, so I hope this helps and thank you for watching and I'll see you next time.